Immunity. Isn't that a wonderful word? It means we're invulnerable. It means we're protected. Wouldn't it be miraculous if we could discover a way to have our immune system trained so that it could protect us against literally hundreds and hundreds of disease-causing germs? Well, let's return to the video and see how this might happen. Wouldn't it be wonderful if we had a transfer factor machine that could stamp out transfer factor memory molecules for hundreds of potential disease-causing germs so that our immune system could best protect us if we were threatened by those germs? Well, we do, and that machine is called Bessie the Cow. And Bessie has provided us with the first way to have protection from disease that's been discovered since Edward Jenner discovered the principle of the vaccine over 200 years ago. This is the most important discovery ever announced in preventive medicine. Now let me repeat that statement. This is the most important discovery ever announced in preventive medicine. And I want you to listen and watch carefully and let me teach you. It's important for you and your family and for everyone you can share this information with. Transfer factors, those protective memory molecules, are the same for all species of mammals. And mammals are defined as any species that produces milk to nourish their offspring. Cows nurse their young, and humans nurse their young. So both cows and humans are mammals. Let me repeat now, all mammals produce transfer factor memory molecules that are molecularly identical. This discovery was one of two momentous discoveries made within the past 10 years. The other discovery was that all transfer factors are transferred to newborns right at and after birth through the mother's first maternal milk called colostrum. This is nature's way of protecting the newborn from disease because the newborn has spent its first months in the sterile environment of the womb and it doesn't know how to recognize germs. But when it nurses, the mother transfers her transfer factors into the newborn and this allows it to survive. Newborn humans who aren't nursed survive because we keep them in a sterile or near sterile environment until their immune systems can mature. But for all other mammals, nursing right after birth is the difference between health and illness and it's often the difference between life and death. Does a light suddenly turn on in your mind? If colostrum is packed with all of a cow's transfer factors, and we could discover a way to remove them and put them in a capsule and consume them on a daily basis, do you see what this could mean? It means we could transfer that ability to recognize disease-causing germs into our bodies, just as the mother transfers that ability into her newborn. It means we could extend the same benefits that the newborn receives into our childhood and into our adulthood and throughout our advanced years and throughout our entire lives. Cows come into contact with every known germ because they have terrible, unsanitary habits. They muck around in a germ-filled world full of viruses and bacteria, full of fungal organisms, full of parasites, and they survive because they have heroic immune systems. Let's use just one germ as an example. A cow comes into contact with a virus. Its immune system defeats that virus. and The cow produces a transfer factor specific for that virus. It moves that transfer factor into its colostrum for the protection, for the education of its newborn. We take some of that colostrum and filter it through a patented filtration process and remove that transfer factor and we put it in a capsule and we consume it. Now we have protection. We have the ability to resist disease from that virus because we have early recognition and we win the numbers game. What you just saw, this transfer of immune system recognition is now possible for hundreds of disease causing germs. We can fortify our immune system with hundreds of recognition codes of bacteria, viruses, parasites, and fungal organisms. And it's the safe, natural way to strengthen our immune system. Because independent lab analysis has revealed that transfer factor has no toxicity. Transfer factor has other properties which are as equally important as its ability to recognize germs and to give us early recognition so we can win the numbers game. Transfer factors are also present which can stimulate the immune system if it's an underachieving system. And these are called inducer transfer factors. And they're suppressor transfer factors which tone down an overachieving immune system. 
an important quality which can help in correcting the autoimmune diseases and the hypersensitivities such as allergies. Transfer factor is truly nature's miracle molecule. We call transfer factor the gift for life because it can be, literally. It can give our immune system intelligence, and our immune system can be the difference in health and illness in survival in an ever-increasingly hostile world filled with disease. And what about the plus in transfer factor plus? Transfer factor provides the intelligence that our immune system needs in order to protect us. And the plus is the added ingredients that provide the strength to implement that intelligence. There are different cells within our immune systems that all have a purpose in our defense. One of these cells is called a macrophage. Now, don't let that name intimidate you. Macro simply means big, and phage means to eat. So a macrophage is a big eater. Macrophages are scavengers. They look for old and injured cells, and they remove them. They attach themselves to germs, and they literally eat them, and they initiate the entire immune response. There's another cell type called cytotoxic T cells. Cytotoxic T cells are cancer fighters. They remove infected cells, and they constantly patrol for abnormal cells which can turn into malignancies, and they remove them. Natural killer cells do the same thing. They're called NK cells. They're especially active in removing cancer cells or any cells in our bodies which look abnormal. Cytotoxic and natural killer. They just sound tough and strong, don't they? And then there are lymphocytes, which are specialized cells for fighting infection, for fighting viruses and bacteria, parasites and fungal organisms. They're the type of cells that the transfer factors influence by stimulating or suppressing their function and by teaching them exactly what they're looking for so that these lymphocytes can produce antibodies which kill germs. The beta-glucons and asomanins stimulate the production of macrophages. And the beta-glucons also stimulate the production of cytotoxic T cells. Cordyceps and IP6 stimulate the production and activity of NK cells, those natural killer cells, which are so important in fighting cancer. The thymic proteins have the ability to stimulate lymphocytes, to train them to be more active so that they can turn into viral and bacterial fighters and to seek out fungal and parasitic organisms. All of this has been researched. All of this information has been documented in numerous scientific journals and books published in countries all over the world. Transfer Factor Plus is truly the ultimate immune system product. It promotes our immune system's natural defense against disease by providing the intelligence for recognition of disease-causing germs. It stimulates cells that are documented by research as being important in removing abnormal cells which can develop into malignancies. It has the ability to stimulate an underachieving immune system and to tone down an immune system which is overactive and can cause autoimmune diseases and allergies. This is why we call Transfer Factor Plus the gift for life, and it's now available.